Okay guys, this is my second plate already. Mm. Fresh. I'm ready to eat my crab. Hello my lovelies and welcome back to another episode of All About Jamie. I am going traveling again so I'm really excited and I'm all packed. It's been quite a hectic month with my home moving and stuff and I'm really glad to get this break. I will be going to Seoul for the cherry blossom season. I have packed some of my clothes to hopefully be able to match the cherry blossom. I'll be doing a more like a relaxing trip. I'm looking forward to eating a lot of Korean yummy food. Just thinking of it, yeah, my favorite raw crabs, ginseng chicken soup, and you name it. Oh, I am really hungry now just thinking about it. Yes, it's a beautiful evening and it is not too cold. Very, very comfortable. Oh, that's very nice of him to yep. bring us. So she will help you to order the menu? Super hungry, looking at the menu. The good thing is low sugar, low oil, low salt. Wow. <laughs> very healthy. Live octopus, but I don't think you'll eat it here. I want, I want, I want it. I want it tonight. Oh, I want it. it. No, I don't care. Oh, yeah, I don't, think I don't care. I want it. I want it. Live octopus. What yes. octopus for penny, huh? Ooh. Mm. Please, come on. You don't have to book the whole restaurant for me, you know? Okay, privacy is the most important. Here comes the raw octopus. It's pretty big and Terence says he wants to share one and I said no, I don't want to share one. So much raw octopus. I can do it. I'm not sure I can finish it. I love it. Let's see how it looks. Whether is it still moving. Yes, it is moving. With the suction and everything. This legit. Legit. What are you doing? So I'm gonna put I love it raw. everything into the sukiyaki sauce to cook it. I tried it and I'm telling you the texture is even better when it's cooked in this sauce. It's softer, it's not so chewy. I got so tired just chewing the live octopus I gave up so I'm just gonna cook it. Little restaurant. Mm -hmm. Hi, Christian. He's so sweet. He brought me a bouquet of flowers. Mm -hmm. There is a nice view from the restaurant. You can see the palace. Christian, you want to take a picture with your daddy? Okay. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit shy. Alright, we're um, trying to walk to the palace. Searching for some place where it's nice to take a photo. Are you gonna dress up in a hamburg? Look at them. I don't know, I'm not even in a mood for that somehow. They look nice. Okay, so here we are at the entrance of the main palace. Are we going to enter? Do you have a place? Uh, yes, but let's go and see how much it is. If you go in there, then you would have to pay. I think they are the gardens. We are all dressed up for the cherry blossom hunt. 
Where are we going? We are going to the Xiaochun Lake. It's um, where the Lotte World Tower is. They said it's a very nice place for cherry blossoms. So hopefully we can get some good cherry blossoms there today. I want to stand out amongst the um, pale pink cherry blossoms. So I am in a goldish outfit. See you later. Beautiful weather today, and we are at the cherry blossom place. We are at Lotte World in Jamzu, where there is this beautiful lake with lots and lots of cherry blossoms. It's still very crowded. I think that the Koreans really like to take their time off to smell the sakura. I'm at a cafe, the Jetta Monster Cafe, they call it the Nudake, is it? Because I want to have that very, very mini croissant and some of these so black pastries, black pastries. This is the cafe here. We got the best seat in the house. Though the lighting is like super really bad here. Oh my god, I look like a disaster. Here comes all the black food. This is a uh, and black croissant. It's very, very tiny mini croissant. Terence is going to eat his black croissant. Yeah. Is it charcoal? Mm, no. Black sesame. Oh, really? This is where they serve the raw crabs. It was recommended to us by a friend, so we're here. Check it out. It's, it's very noisy. Ginseng, ginseng. ginseng. Yeah. Check it out. Check it out. Plenty of ginseng. Wow, I'm very excited. I hope the white light is flattering. Yeah, it's very good lighting. Oh, really? But it's not facing you. So I gotta do this again. Wow. This is my favorite. Okay, you look like you're salivating already. Yeah, stop filming. More eating. Let's go. Beautiful. Oh, it's moving. It is moving. Eating like octopus again. Fresh. Fresh and, and crunchy. Crunchy. Mm. Okay, yeah, good, yeah. I'm ready to eat my crab. <laughs> so this is called Eja. It's a Korean raw crab dish. I like it with soya sauce. Best. They have the spicy marinated version, but I'm not hot, too hot with that. Mm. This is amazing. Oh my God. You're supposed to like. Actually, you're just supposed to. Oh, so good. And a dollop of rice. It's indescribable. It's like the most delicious thing on earth, okay? Like what? Mm. I don't know what delicious tastes like. It's very sweet. Okay, sweet. These are flower crab. Flower crabs, I see. You can see from the print, it's a flower crab. It's full of roll though, yeah, look at that. Yeah, it's full wow. of roll. The, the beauty is in the roll. Okay guys, this is my second plate already. I'm such a big fan of this raw octopus. I just have to eat many of it because we don't really get that in Singapore. Oh my God. Mm -mm -mm. This is amazing. This is the first time I'm eating this dish. It has got crab roll, seaweed and an egg in there. Sorry I had some already so it's yeah. destroyed. To let you know that I've had many crabs and two plates of octopus, let's see if this still tastes good. Mm. It's good. Oh, you are in pink again. I want to borrow that pink jacket. 
You can. So we are going to head out for lunch at the Dior Cafe. Very pretty and you guys know how much I love Dior so... Having lunch at the beautiful Dior Cafe. I really love this vibe. And it's making me toy with the idea of this Toit de Jouy parasol for the new home. It looks so cute here. I love it. But what if it gets dirty? I'm going to be so sad. It looks $10,000. Uh, your metal here was going to get... God, shopping again, but I thought there's no shopping in so you're gonna Paris and here you are shopping again. Oh, I like this green pea coat. Yes, it's very nice. It's really nice. Very nice color. Yeah. Green is absolutely my color. It always looks so nice in here. Yeah, you can do all your photo shoots, sit down, yes. do whatever. Oh. It's like your own house. Yeah. Let me try on this trench that I've been eyeing for the longest time. To be honest, it looks like a Burberry, the old Burberry trench yeah, coat. Yeah, but it's quite sh quite nice when you. Well, the shape is nice. The cutting is actually quite flattering. It's not the usual cutting for a trench coat, I guess. And the length is perfect. Blossoms all Gone with the wind. Gone. Gone with the rain. I guess we're the only ones here today because there's nothing here. It's barren. Well, no let's crowd. Take some, uh, barren cherry blossom. <coughs> no pictures. crowd at all. And cherry blossom season. I would suggest um, first week of April is the best time. Second week. By now it's all gone. I'm um, too cold. <laughs> okay, bye. It's too barren now. Bye. Cherry blossoms are gone. Gone, okay. Bye. <laughs> oh my god, look at this departmental store. It is so nice. This is like my favorite mall. It's called the Hyundai Mall. I'm going to look for a hot pot restaurant because I'm still feeling very, very cold from the walk here. Yay! I found a Shabu Shabu restaurant. And I think I deserve these hot meals. I'm happy whenever there's shabu shabu. <laughs> A bowl of soup, vegetables, and some hearty beef. We've come back to the room because it is simply too cold out there and the wind is so strong today. My skirt is practically like whoosh whoosh flying up. I'm going to go to the spa in the hotel and get myself a good Korean scrub and a massage. I think that is the best thing to do on a day like that. And what's Terence going to do? I'm going to eat Korean strawberries. Mm. Alright guys, I'm off to get my Korean scrub and massage and all dressed comfy in my favourite blue salt outfit. Bye! <laughs> it was such a long way in the cab. I fell asleep and uh, yes, we're here for dinner at Mingo's. It's one of the best uh, Korean restaurants in Seoul. So we're really excited to try it. It is a Michelin star, is it Michelin star? Two. Two Michelin stars. I can't wait. I have never had a Korean Michelin star food before. Let me share the menu with you guys. Uh, it looks like a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 14 course dinner including tea and coffee. So cheers guys! And the first course is gone. This is a soybean paste soup with 10 kinds of seasonal vegetables and fruits. There you go, look at this. Yep. Where's the fruit? Well... Hey guys!
guys, we've come to the end of the trip. We are at the airport and as you can see, it is quite quiet. Uh, it's early in the morning and uh, we are quite sad to leave because there's so much good food here. I think I mm -hmm. put on so much weight. Uh, time to exercise when I get back. It's a wonderful trip. We love so and it's uh, cherry blossom time. If you want to come, First week of April, remember, it's the best time for cherry blossom. We managed to catch the tail end. Yeah. Um, but like of course, when you travel days. to Seoul, you need to be aware of like the requirements. You need to fill up uh, an online registration. I, th I think it's called a Q code system. Yes. So do it before you mm -hmm. arrive in the airport. Otherwise, you can get stuck for you know a bit of a delay. But yeah, you have to do one pre-departure. You get into the airport, do another test. Um, mm -hmm. and then pre-departure before you leave so you can do an ART now instead of a PCR so yeah. that was quite easy but just beware of the requirements and you have a very wonderful trip to Seoul yes till next time see you guys see